Hello everyone and welcome to a new Paint With Me session working on this brand new canvas. I hope you're all doing okay and are staying safe. I am very excit excited to start working on this Paint By Numbers which have cold <laughs> winter landscape. So I'm getting all the paints ready, I have ironed the canvas and I'm ready to start painting. So I need to decide first on the strategy I'm going to do with this one. So in the two previous paint by numbers that I've did, I did section by section, which I quite enjoyed. But I know lots of you have different methods, like doing from light to dark or from dark to light, um, or just from one to 12, which I've never tried. So, also got myself some fresh water, as <laughs> you just saw. Um, so yeah, I'm thinking of trying one of these methods um, that I haven't tried before. But I guess this canvas has a lot of white, like snow type of, um, well, cream, yellowish colors. Um, well, I haven't quite decided. Let me know down in the comments what you think I should do for this particular paint by numbers. Um, which reminds me, if you haven't seen the unboxing, um, I posted it last Sunday, yeah. Um, so go and check that one out, then you can see clearly the design that I'm going to do, that's hopefully going to be this one. And then you'll see I got this one from AliExpress. What I will do today is that I will start with number one in the top left corner. There is accidentally number one, which is also a um, pink whitish color. So I will start off with that one and then you guys can decide what I should do <laughs> from light to dark or section by section. And these ones are numbered, so I have to look up which one it is exactly, but I found it. <laughs> and I readjust the camera, we're ready to start painting. For me, this is always the most satisfying moment, is when you open the pot and the paint looks beautifully and still full. I don't know, am I the only one that thinks it's super satisfying to see in the first time you open the paint pot. And it is a really nice, yeah, pinkish color actually. Um, I can start off with the big brush, which is really nice, but I don't think I can do it for much longer. <laughs> Uh, lots of small details in this paint by numbers, um, but that's okay, I don't mind, um, hopefully the end result will be pretty. I suspect this number, number one, is going to be transparent though, just because of the, the pigment. And the areas next to this section number 2 and 11 which I already saw is also like a light color so I'm immediately going in and painting over the lines. I made a video about why I do that um, but basically I don't want to see the lines so I just go over them now I'm ready with one coat and then I um, maybe it needs a second coat of going on top of it but I can do that with the other paint when you have two light sections next to each other. I will try that out here. Uh, but definitely going on top of the lines immediately. <laughs> it feels a bit rebellious, but it's I don't want any white sections, you know. It's not pretty if you have, or in my opinion, not pretty when um, you have like two yeah, too much white and the line's still showing. Have you made any winter 
or Christmas inspired paintings. I this is the first one and I'm so excited because I had to wait for such a long time, right? That you're really excited. I knew all along this was going to be the next painting I was going to work on. Um, because I wanted to do something seasonal and winter related, Christmas related. Well, it's too late for Christmas now, <laughs> but winter is still in full swing. And it looks like we're going to be home <laughs> still a long time. So definitely more time to paint and can't wait. I already said that, I'm sorry. <laughs> You can tell I'm just excited to do a new painting. Um, yeah, let me know if you are working on a winter landscape as well. That would be so much fun. Um, although, yeah, I'm not sure if I've said this before, but I am a bit worried about all the snow and transparent paint, so... We'll see how that goes. I might need a lot of adjusting here, lots of extra layers and so on. In case you were wondering or you're new to the channel, for this paint by numbers I'm also going to do a paint with me session every Thursday at 4 o'clock um, UK time, British winter time. <laughs> yes, um, so I hope you will follow me along and we can do some paint by numbers together even though we're far away we can still be close together and work on our paintings which is why i like this thursday so much to just chat with you guys and paint which is what we like to do now right <laughs> During my last Paint by Numbers, it was requested that I do these videos in normal one time speed. Is that still what you would prefer? Um, let me know in the comments if you prefer <laughs> um, more time lapse kind of style or like you're happy with this as well. Um, for now, I think I will just yeah do one time speed um, so I'm not I'm really painting with you guys at the same time and I can speed it up if yeah that's what people prefer sorry I'm rumbling on uh, like always I think I should stop here <laughs> and stop rumbling away I want to thank you for watching until the end today and for um, painting with me hopefully <laughs> I hope to see you again next Sunday with a paint by numbers video and please hit the subscribe button if you haven't I make twice a week paint by numbers videos and I would really appreciate it if you subscribe and help me to reach a thousand subscribers real soon. So thank you very much for your support. I really appreciate it and I hope you're having fun painting. Stay safe and see you next time. Bye!